The death toll from Friday's explosion at a Pennsylvania chocolate factory has now risen to seven. Rescue teams had been searching for survivors for two days. One person was found alive in the rubble. Authorities are investigating the cause of the explosion. And today's cost m s has updates on the tragic event. The search for missing people concluded on Sunday. A total of seven people have perished. Ten people were injured and taken to local hospitals. One person was found alive in the early hours of Sunday morning. The explosion happened around 5 p.m. local time on Friday at RM Palmer Chocolate Factory in West Reading. Well, it was a, the biggest explosion that I ever heard in my life. And uh, at first I thought the trains came off the railroad track and hit the ground. <laughs> But uh, and then I looked out the window and I saw all the debris on the road from the building and the building was just gone. It is currently still unclear what caused the explosion. Some employees of the factory had reported a gas smell prior to the blast, although no reports were made with a local utility company. Community efforts were underway to offer food and water to rescue workers. When something crazy like this happens to the community, like, you want to make sure people are taken care of. So we just made some food to donate to like, the first responders, make sure everybody is taken care of in like, times like these. The explosion destroyed one of the buildings completely. Another building on the grounds was partially destroyed. Some nearby residents reported their windows were smashed by the blast. Three adjacent buildings were closed off as a precautionary measure pending further investigation. West Reading Mayor Samantha Kag said the loss is devastating. A community fundraiser has already collected over $20,000. Cost MNS, NTD News.